lot of fights are ready to rumble. Here we come on a turn number four. Green flag flies the 50 lap feature event on the way. And Super Matt Shepard from the outside grabs the early race lead right now, putting Higby at bay down to the inside. Higby takes the 51 car down low with Bobby Flood in tow down the back straightaway. Flood works into the number three spot. Stuart Friesen already on the move, deep in the heart of this pack. Williamson opening up the inside, land down the back straight away right now. Schilling knows he's got to go to work. As Schilling maintaining a top five run to the lineup right now in the number four spot. Field out of turn number four. It is Super Matt in the number nine car, holding on to the number one spot. Bobby Flood, great job in spot two. Higby is third right now, Schilling is fourth. Mega Money Matt back there in slot number five. Here comes Kid Giddy at Perego. Perego's on the outside and also McKinney coming through the pack. Right now, Bobby Flood has got to get on the gas because we got problems somewhere. Yellow lights now coming on. Here we go. Shepard again. He's the leader of the pack. The shepherd of the flock, so to speak, as he goes back into the number one spot. Perego time to work some magic. Lost a little footing on that restart. Now he threads the needle three wide out of turn number two, and Perego is back on the rebound. Down the back straight away into the number three spot. And he'll go to work on the flood car. Here they come on a turn number four. Trying to knock on Destiny's door down the back straight away, pick it off, lap traffic as we run through the field with only nine laps left to go. Shepard well on his way to a visit to Victory Lane tonight. He's only got a lot of lap traffic between himself and second place man, David Schilling. Working to the outside and getting around Demetrius Trellos. Now he's trying to lap Alan Parker. He can't do so, but guess what? Second, third, and fourth Not are beginning far. to quickly close in yes. on Matt Shepard. Schilling, Perego, and Williamson now reaching lap traffic. Shepard now working to the outside of Alan Barker. He will now make the move and get by the B16. Three lap cars between spots number one and two. Perego goes to the wild side. Perego steps upstairs. And Perego races way up on the banking. May lose some footing to Matt Williamson. Brings her back down to reality. Those three cars, you can throw a blanket over them down the back straightaway. We're talking second, third, and fourth. And Perego got the step on Schilling. Perego's way up on the bobsled trail. And he may pick up the number two spot. No, he doesn't. Schilling's got his work cut out for him now. Perego Williamson right behind him. Larry White not that far behind them as they work heavy traffic into turn three. Yep, three lap traffic cars in front of them right now. They are on those in tail battling for the number two spot. Schilling at the head of the class right now in spot number two. Perego's on the inside of Schilling. Lap traffic ahead of him. Boy, talk about strategy right now. As Perego got the number two spot, Super uh, uh, Matt Williams and tries to follow suit, but he does not have the horsepower to make the pass. Final lap, 50 laps, $5,000. Hark Clay finale win will go to Matt Shepard. Shepard will take the win. Runner-up spot will go to Anthony Perego. Following him is Matt Williamson.